Hello and welcome back to the Craft Kitchen. Welcome back to January. Christmas is over. We started on the first with that Guinness blind taste test. Today I'm going to start at the top. Well, second beer in for dry January. It's Bavaria alcohol 0, 0.0. I swear by it. So I'm going to give it a try. We've got the Schooner glass, Brewdog 330ml, made for these cans. Mineral water, barley and all the rest. 0, 0.0 Bavaria. I've talked about this a few times on the channel already. Uh, light golden beer there. Um, bit of a head to it. It's got a slight golden tan to the head, which doesn't come through on camera, it's white. Um, just got this out of the fridge, fridge pack. Four quid for eight. So I don't know if they do it in bottles. Smell is kind of a little bit citrusy to it, but it it's a regular lager smell but nowhere near as bad as that Brewdog Hoppy Christmas smell we were going about before, just after Christmas in the bumper pack, so. Crisp, little bit of fizz, love that. I drink this more than cola some weeks, because I don't drink in the week. Oh my God, that's lovely light color. Um, it's a lovely taste. It's a bit of a bite to it on the back, but not too much. The crispness hits you first. Um, there's not much I can say about this. I've not really said loads of times before. This is the best, in my opinion. Unless uh, I change my mind. I'm going to try some new ones this month, as well as some other ones I've tried before. But as far as non-alcoholic beer goes, that does the job. It tastes as good as if you can't drink alcohol or you don't want to get drunk or you've got to drive. Or for health reasons, I would recommend that non-stop. Till the cows come home. Looks great, tastes great. But I have got it chilled. I would suggest chilling it. But that does the job. It's good beer. Good non-alcoholic beer. So for me, yay or nay, that's a yay. And I will see you next time in dry January. Cheers for watching.